Hey, Steve Mignone here at High Octane Classics in Auburn, Massachusetts with something interesting and unusual. No, it's not an American muscle car, but it is a muscle car, at least if you consider it by 1980s standards. It's a 1985 Toyota, Toyota Celica Supra. Now, if you're familiar with their 80s Japanese cars, the Celica was a very popular eh, family car, a compact. The Supra was a Celica on steroids. It had a longer wheelbase by four inches, and instead of a four-cylinder engine, it had an inline six. It was essentially Toyota's com competitor to the Datsun 280Z, but unlike the 280Z, the Supra was a four-seater. Unless you got a 280Z 2 plus 2, the 280 was a two-seater. So Toyota kind of hit Datsun where they weren't back in the mid-80s with the Supra. Uh, let's take a peek under the hood and see what we have, and yeah, there it is. This is the 2.8 liter dual overhead cam, four valve inline six, 170 horsepower. And keep in mind, to fit this engine under the Supra's hood, Toyota lengthened the wheelbase from the firewall to the nose by four inches versus the four cylinder Celica. So the Supra is far more than a quick engine swap in a small car. And something also gives away the Celica Supra is the wheel flares. Now the Supra was available as the L luxury model, same six cylinder engine, but this is the P version, which is the performance version, which had seven inch wide wheels and four wheel fender flares right here, not seen on the L. And that separates this. This is kind of the best one to have. And again, these wheels in their time were very high tech stuff, forged aluminum. And again, these are seven inch wide wheels specifically to the P or prefer performance version of the Supra. Now this one is a very low mile original car, something like 30,000 or, or less miles on this one. Original paint, factory sunroof, a very expensive option. Inside, pristine and virginal. The original bucket seats inside. Power everything. Power windows. Uh, and one thing you won't find is an automatic transmission. While that could be had in the Supra L luxury, the Supra S or so P performance cars all came with a nice five-speed manual transmission. So this is a great example of what a Toyota Celica Supra would have looked at, like back in 1985. Uh, truly an unmolested car. Now the thing about this is that these cars new sold for 16000 dollars and change, which was about oh, 4,000 bucks more than an IROC Z Camaro, but about seven or 8,000 bucks less than a Corvette. Not that you'd necessarily cross shop those cars, but if you wondered, these were fairly expensive cars in their day. Now, something the Supra also has that the Celica does not is independent rear suspension and four wheel disc brakes. A standard Celica would have had a live axle, coil springs and little tiny drums. But again, the Supra from front to rear was a performance model. In fact, the suspension on these was designed with cooperation from Lotus. Yeah, Lotus of England. Another thing too on this Supra is the optional spoiler on the top and bottom of the hatch. And this is something you paid a lecture for along with the billboard Supra stripe in the back. And this lets you know that you are riding behind Toyota's pretty much premier muscle version circa 1985. Let's take a peek inside the hatch and see what we find. And again, this is an unrestored all original car. You gotta love it. Here's the, uh, the inside of the hatch. Hatchbacks, of course, were huge business in the mid-1980s. And underneath the original uh, carpeting, we find the spare tire right there. This is the original spare with the unused Dunlop tire. You gotta love this, a brand new Supra alloy wheel right there, never been on the ground. <laughs> I mean, how cool is that? <clears throat> and again, it's an all original car, very pure. And these 80s and, and late 70s Japanese muscle cars, supercars, performance cars are really coming on strong. And so get in ahead of the curve with this one. It's an unrestored original example. These things are heating up. So uh, that's the story of this 84 Celica Super, 85 Celica Super. Uh, if you want to learn more, go to the High Octane Classics website. And if you ever thought about maybe selling or working on muscle cars and specialty cars like this, High Octane Classics is always looking for sales and service techs. And also, they're looking to buy cars, uh, one or five cars or 50 cars. Give them a call at 508-859-4515. And High Octane Classics will also finance this car with as little as 10% down and deliver it to your place of work if you'd like. And they do consider all trades, late models, classic classics, even other Supras. So if you want to upgrade from a, a standard Celica to a Celica Supra or enjoy one of the greatest Toyota performance cars of all time, <clears throat> you want to check this car out. To learn more, go to the High Octane Classics website.